Welcome back to KCBD Sports Extra. Time now for the end zone team of the week and getting the team ball this week. It is the Floyd Ada Whirlwinds head coach J.R. Compton. Congrats. They beat Lockney this week 35-21 in the Floyd County Championship. They are 2-0 on the year. Congrats to these guys. Let's start talking to Coach Compton. Well, first off, Coach, congrats on being the end zone team of the week. Thank you. We appreciate every bit of it. Coach, uh, talk about this game with, uh, you know, with Lockney. It's obviously you guys are close proximity. I mean, it's a real rivalry over 100 years played. It is. And, and that, that's the thing about the uh, anytime you play in a rivalry, you know, it doesn't matter how one team's doing, how the other team doing. It's always going to be a tough game. And uh, Coach Tebow does a good job with, the, with those guys over there. And that's why it ended up being such a good game for us. You guys jumped out early in that one. We did, but... You know, uh, we talk to them all the time about withstanding the storm. And uh, like I said, in a rivalry game, you know, we jumped out early, but we knew the fight wasn't over, and uh, they proved it. 2-0 uh, and o now on the year. What is the strength of this team? Uh, I would say they're the resiliency. You know, uh, we started this thing uh, three years ago, and uh, these guys have learned to persevere through a lot of stuff. You know, that's part of our uh, motto, Kahila Ho Maoa. And that means uh, persevere and carry on, okay? And uh, I think that's the biggest deal that they've learned to battle through no matter what. And obviously you've seen improvement every year and, and off to this, uh, you know, 2-0 and start. Uh, we have uh, the first year we were 3-8. and eight. Then uh, last year we uh, kind of righted the ship. We went 6-5 uh, and five and we'll see where this, this year ends for us. Like I said, these kids, uh, they've, gone a, they've come a long way. And, uh, you know, that's the ultimate deal is to see the improvement year after year. And then just talk about the community of Floyd 8. I'm sure a lot of people know about the Pumpkin Week and stuff, but, man, it's a, it's a great community out there. <laughs> yeah, uh, Pumpkin Day is coming up the <laughs> second weekend in October. But uh, the community of uh, Floyd 8 is just unreal. You know, a lot of support there. And uh, they want to they see these guys do good. And what's up next now for the Whirlwinds? Uh, this Friday night, we'll have the Smire Bobcats in uh, Smire. And obviously, uh, you know, you can't look ahead, but man, you know you're in one of the toughest districts around. It, it is. You know, uh, you still have uh, two teams in there who not too long ago were, are coming off of uh, state final runs with uh, New Deal and Post. And then you, then you throw in a Sundown and a... And a Tahoka and Olton's a playoff team. I think when we started the year, we looked at it, including scrimmages, I believe eight or nine of the teams that were on our that are on our schedule were all playoff teams. And so uh, obviously off to a good start. Off to a great start. Anytime you can start uh, two and zero, it's good. All right, let's talk to Armando. Big win over a rival there. Uh, obviously a, a big game when you go out and, and go into Lockney and get the win. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, we we went hard on both sides of the ball. Um, we really, uh, over the past years, we really improved over offense and defense. Um, and I'm really proud of where we stand right now. Was there any smack talk? I mean, do you guys hit each other up on social media and stuff? I mean, I'm sure some of those guys are your friends. Oh, yeah. Uh, there was a lot uh, during the week. Yeah. But, you know, all of us try to ignore it. We're staying focused on the game and just uh, try to bring that trophy back home. Yeah, and obviously you guys jumped out to an early start, 14-0, and, and then mm -hmm. held on to win 35-21. Yes, sir. Uh, Man, we went off the first two quarters, man. We're going off, uh, doing our best. Um, uh, we came out at halftime, and um, they ended up coming back. They came uh, harder than they did in the first two quarters. Uh, but we just kept uh, outplaying them and uh, going harder than them, and we came out with a win. What's it, to, what's it mean to you to be a Floyd Ada whirlwind? It means a lot. Um, I really grew up here when I was younger. Um, I grew up with most of these guys. I played with them when I was in junior high. Uh, I, played them, I played with them when I was in... Uh, third and fourth grade, we had, a, we had our own team. Uh, it, really, it means a lot to me to play with these guys. Uh, they're like family to me, they're like brothers. Um, and it just means a lot to me. The community too, uh, I love to be in this community. They're, there's a lot of supporters and everything. Uh, and these coaches, they're amazing. They're, they, push, they push all of us every day. And um, I'm proud to have them as coaches. You've seen the change year to year to year and, and seen the improvement with this program. Yes, sir. Uh, when I first started off, uh, I was smaller than I was before, and then like th these coaches came in, and Coach Compton really hit us hard about getting the weight room and and uh, being a team player and, and everything. He hit all of us about it, and um, we he really pushed us to be the best that we can be. And he uh, he can see you can see it out of all of us. We, uh, we really go hard every day, 
and uh, we do our best in every sport in every sport that we do. All right, Edgar, let's get your thoughts. Big win. You get bring back that Floyd County Championship trophy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So I've been playing since I was a freshman, and you know our freshman year it was COVID, so we didn't get to play them. But overall, they're a good team. They came out. I mean, of course, there's a rivalry, so they come out fired up, everything. How calm to say, you know, you got to stand the whistle storm, and we come out on top. What was the talk in the community? I know, you know, you, they wanted to definitely win that game. Yeah, I mean, the community was in there, the whole Floyd County, actually. Yeah. Everybody was making sure. It was a big thing, just, and I'm just glad we came out on top of it. Well, having been with this program all these years now, do you see the difference? I mean, obviously, there's improvement every year. Yeah, so whenever uh, Coach Compton came in, he changed the offense, messed, messed with the defense, and now there's improvement every year. So how he said, two and eight, or three and eight, and now six and five, and hopefully a better record this year. And then we'll talk about this team. I mean, obviously you guys got to be a close-knit team and, and talk about being part of the whirlwinds. Yeah, so Armando said, you know, we've been playing since third, third or fourth grade, sixth grade, or all in there. So we have a lot of experience. You know, most of our seniors and juniors, so we've been playing like all along with each other. So hopefully we just built the chemistry up and it was going to continue. All right, up next is Hagen and big win. Obviously, uh, you know, when you're playing a, a team like that, Floyd County Championship, over 100 years. Uh, I'm sure you've heard the history growing up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, it was a big rivalry game. Uh, there was a lot of smack talk coming into the game um, all week. Uh, her back, smack talk back and forth, back and forth. It was an exciting game to play. And uh, you guys jumped out early. I think that was the key. And, and you probably, you know, got to calm down nerves and, and go from there. Yes, sir. We jumped out on them early. Uh, we, we stayed in it. We stayed in it. And they came back in the second half and uh, hit harder than they did in the first half. I think it was the 101st uh, Floyd County Championship. Uh, yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. I'm glad we brought the trophy home. Uh, I've had it for two years now, <laughs> and uh, glad we came out on top. Take a look at them. The Floyd Ada Whirlwinds, the end zone team of the week, bringing back that Floyd County Championship trophy, the 101st edition, taking on Lockney. And now they'll go and take on Smire this week. Congrats to these guys. Stay with us. We'll wrap up Sports Extra when we come back.